The name Myanmar comes from the Burmese Myanmar, which means fast and strong people. But for most women here, they stay at home and do the household jobs. There isn't much support for the women to be educated here, but they are responsible for the overall well-being of the family. This is also for their access to health care, especially surrounding childbirth. Only one third of women in Myanmar will be referred to give birth in a hospital, and only a quarter of them will actually reach the hospital because transportation is so difficult here. It results in unnecessary deaths of both women and children. For me, it was different. My mother supports uh, me to attend the school and the university and she allowed to attend the many trainings and uh, she also allowed me to work everywhere I want to go. That it is very supportive for me. My hope for the women in Myanmar is to be independent, educated and free to stand up for themselves so that all of the people of Myanmar become strong. A lot of villages are hard to reach and transportation is very difficult for the local people. We are working with the people to advance their knowledge and help develop the village. To get to this village, firstly we need to leave from Yangon to Bate. It takes five hours long and then we, from Bate to Tawang it takes one hour and uh, from Tawang to the bank it takes 15 minutes by motorbike and then we need to take a boat and another motorbike to go to the village. Since they are so rural, they have very poor resources for medical or health counselor visits and they cannot go to the hospital. Some children cannot reach for higher education. Some people are facing difficulties because of the harsh environment and challenging geographical areas. So everything seems difficult for many people. <laughs> ก็อาชีพของเราเสร็จตรงนี้ส่วนที่เดียวแล้วก็ขึ้นกับเตะก่อนเลยแล้วมาเสร็จตรงนี้เดี๋ยวมันชี้เยอะที่มาไปโตเ
when I met Zin, I felt very sorry and sad because she has to work hard for herself and her family to get food each day. If my dream is to come true for women, to be free and to stand up for themselves, they need to be supported and educated. They need to be full of knowledge about what is happening around them and all over the world. I want to help this change occur. <laughs>